أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أنا محمد حفيظ so today I will share with you about slowly loop lecture which is in a topic of second type writing okay actually this is my first time using a screencast so I hope I can deliver to you at my best okay shall we start now so the concept of a slurry loop rate the first one is a particle dispersion what is particle dispersion particle dispersion is a collection of solid catalyst which is a solid catalyst particle will disperse into a liquid phase so that is called slurry next one is a the mix the mixing pattern is a very we can see a very intensive and well defined so it will mix well in this type of reactor so uh third one is uh the serial uh loop reactor is circulating at a high a very high velocity impel uh impelled by an axial pump so what is actually axial pump okay next slide okay axial pump uh this is uh what we call axial pump the real one so look at the graphics okay axial pumps uh is the pump used in a uh this slurry group reactor so how it works okay i will i will share with you how it works so we can see that this is a drive shaft and attached to the propeller propeller okay which is uh axial pump uh commonly uh in the shape of elbow uh berbentuk siku okay macam ni uh how it works so when the propeller turn on when the propeller turn on it will uh the blade pull the this blade so the three blades will pull up the fluid up with a very high uh pressure uh so this is how axial pump works okay uh usually <coughs> Usually, uh, slurry reactor is used in a polymerization process. Okay, so we go next to the information. So this is uh some information that I get from my research. So usually, slurry reactor are in the three phase reactors, which is a uh, solid, liquid, and gas. This reactor usually used in a production of ethylene production. So ethylene production usually use this type of reactor. Okay. Okay, usually uh, it is con consists of catalyst suspended in a liquid through through which a uh, gas is bubble. So the next one is a uh, slurry reactor can operate in either semi batch or continuous mode. And the last one is a uh, usually slurry reactor are most frequently used when a liquid in liquid uh reactant must be contacted with a solid catalyst and when a reaction when a reaction has the high heat of reaction okay so this is uh uh the real one of a slurry reactor uh why it's called a loop because uh some reactor is just one loop and some reactor can has uh, it has uh double loop Okay, you can see this uh, operator looking up on the operator, and this is the the uh, loop operator, the type of loop operator. Okay, so uh, this is the equipment design. So we can watch this video. Okay, how usually it works? Okay, inside the reactor, uh, a catalyst pellet is uh, suspended in the liquid. So we can see it is suspended in the liquid. Okay, uh, the gas rate is bubble. You can see the gas rate is bubble into the reactor. This is bubble. So okay, and then uh, the absorbable gas is will be diffused through what we call through the liquid uh, to the catalyst surface at which point is diffused into the catalyst pellet. In the so the reaction will take place, okay. So we will watch again. 
okay so uh, this is uh, example uh, the use of a slow rate reactor so the synthesis of methanol okay when you can see this uh, infographic so uh, how it works is a syn gas feed syn gas feed you enter the bottom of the reactor uh, into the heat mix uh, mineral oil mineral the gas will react with the existence suspended which the gas will uh, react with the suspended with the, with the presence of catalyst and will produce uh, methanol okay then so the, uh, this process will release uh, some gases so the gases this uh, will go to uh, the top of the reactor and once the reactor once the gas out from, uh, got out from the reactor it will condense back to the liquid okay Okay, this is uh, the other usage examples uh, by using this reactor. So the first one is uh, hydrogenation, oxidation, hydroformation, and ethanylation. So this is some uh, information that I get uh, from my research on slurry rope reactor. Okay, that's all from me. Uh, see you next time. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.